One of the requests from uh, you guys uh, that I received was a coin called Neo, and I usually don't um, do this, but just a quick brief um, taking this from Coin Micro Cap. Um, they build themselves as a rapidly growing and developing ecosystem that has the goal of becoming the foundation for the next generation on the internet. New economy where digitized payments, identities and assets come together. Um, certainly do more research into this, guys, uh, if you're interested. I am going to really only concentrate, as always, on um, the chart more and your entry points uh if you have a bag where you could possibly make something out of it um and where you could possibly uh see this go in the future again don't be something i want to say is please don't ever ask me where do i think this coin is going to be in the bull market i have no idea okay the simplest rule is buy here, 2x, sell half, let the rest ride. That's that's all you need to do, guys. Rotate those profits. That's how you maximize your gains. And waiting for a price target and not realizing any profits along the way, the dumbest move ever. All right? Don't let the market take your hard-earned money from you. Those profits may not mean nothing if you give them back to the market, right? Um, back in, of course, when? January, I'm sure. <laughs> we pretty much, this coin came all the way back down to retest the previous lows uh all the way 2018 2020 and we've bounced from that that level interesting definitely if, if you are uh, keeping an eye on this um coin because the risk to reward ratio from here was certainly worth uh keeping an eye on so i'm gonna just start from what i always do is use the 8 and 21 just to talk about um that entry level that uh, we identify as the bullish uh, cross um, and very easy in, and interesting way to you know enter as a long-term investor. And what you can see here all the way in February, we've had that cross, we've had the retest of this level, um, another retest here in March and a bit of side action here. So it is retesting on the weekly, um, that uh, eight EMA, sorry, wrong button. Let's look at, right, 50, 50 uh, EMA is actually acting a bit of uh, here, like as a resistance. Mm, so that will be in the level for you to watch. Again, two ways probably to look at this uh, is either you, want to start thinking about the saying from here or wait for that breakout uh, once it breaks out uh above the 50 there is another uh, resistance we'll be looking at here around 22 but that's giving you nearly a nice um 2x from here right so that is not a bad trade if you're into um if you're into, well, it's not really 2x here, but you can't say no to 60% either, you know? Um, or even 70. It's gonna bring it up to about that. Uh, another just probably, I, I, I kinda wanna point out as well, uh, guys, when you're setting buy orders or sell orders, don't be so obvious with your choices because there are, thousands and thousands and thousands of people that will be buying on the dot and there might not be enough for you to grab your bag so just either lower the small bit be reasonable don't be greedy both directions for the bottoms and tops um 
potential. Again, I said, don't ask too much of, uh, uh, of me in terms of these things because the coin has infinite uh, possibility, uh, but it's about where you take the profit, basically. In terms of entering this, uh, let's just check on the daily. Um, actually, I'm going to try my trading alpha as well. So it's retesting that track line. I, I, I think, guys, you know, it's it's looking well. Obviously, it broke out of this downtrend, right? Uh, but it's it's not it hasn't pumped uh, into oblivion yet. It's doing some side action. It's retesting key levels. It's retesting uh, the EMAs. This is uh, a nice entry level, given even if that was to come back again and go into about maybe ten dollar mark. Once again, it's not the end of the world, you know. When you understand how market moves. And you are entering, giving yourself that entry where you're not going to miss out on this if it moves to the upside and never gives you any deeper, deeper retests. And that's how you want to be making money in this market. It's amazing uh, to find gems super early and hold through your thousand X, but that's super rare. You still need patience for that. It never happens overnight. Uh, so yeah, Neo, I think, um, I'm saying I'll check on the daily for you as well. Um, what it's looking like, hope you can see this. I'm going to move myself a small bit of the screen. Ah, I was do it. Sorry. Wrong screen. I'm moving the wrong screen. <laughs> and there we go. You know, I love this indicator as well. And guys, this is a free indicator. All you need is time to understand it. And then it's going to pay you back. So that level here in around 13, I think this is looking swell. It's coiling up. Let me check. RSI looks good. Let me check volume as well. I need a big, bigger screen, guys. I do need a bigger screen. I do. One day soon. I think. Let's turn this off for a second. Where's the reward in terms of this dropping lower and taking off is worth, in my opinion, um, getting in now. Unless you are looking at a scalp, then I want to invite you again to my Discord where we can try and catch something. But on a long, um, long, um, longer time frame, I think you're you're still within an uh, amazing opportunity uh, and you haven't missed much. This this moved, but it's retesting very key levels. If it drops um, DCA, and I think you're, you're going to be um, happy out going forward. So I think that's it for Neo. If you have any more co comments about this uh, coin, if you want to share um, why you're holding it, what's so uh, interesting about it, I, um got you request me um got you to request me to do to um talk about this please write it in your um in the comments all right okay.